What's going on, beautiful people? It is I, your flying locomotive, and faster than a speeding bullet supercliff, coming at you live with a brand new video. And for today's majestic and fantastic video, we are continuing with DC's World's Finest, more specifically the story surrounding our characters. For today, we have Batman Superman World's Finest Annual 2024. But before we dive into the world of DC and the happenings involving Earth-22 and the things that can affect it, if you are new to the channel, then smash that like and subscribe button. That way you guys never miss out on anything that happens on this majestic channel. So what are you waiting for? Let's raise the bar and go full on Super Saiyan. Hit that subscribe button. With also without further ado, let's save the world with Batman Superman World's Finest Annual 2024. Real quick, this annual contains about five different stories from five different writers. The only one involving the main plot from World's Finest will be the one that I cover story-wise. Once we get to the review section, that's where I'll provide my take for everything else. But yeah, just an FYI. Now check it, folks. Our story begins in the fifth dimension. While our heroes are fighting off the machinations of Gog and that of Darkseid's invasion, here we have the imps wearing a Justice League-esque attire. And they're here gathered for a meeting, one which is being held by Batmites and their leader, Mr. McSpitlet. Now, I know I definitely butchered that name, so please feel free to <laughs> feel free to shit on me in the comment section. I welcome it. Now, remember, these are imps with superhero fanboy impulses, so it takes a while for Mr. McSpitlet and Batmite to gather everyone's attention. Mr. McSpitlet starts off saying that there is strength in numbers, and right now we need that strength more than ever before because a dark storm approaches. However, before any of the imps could take this seriously, Green Might the Green Lantern Imp version, gets shot by an arrow, and it's right through the chest, like Bormir. It turns out that supervillain imps have taken their fandom to the next level, for we see the fifth dimensional imp versions of Earth's supervillains. And this dark storm is exactly what Mr. McSpicklet was talking about. This is precisely what he was trying to warn everyone about. And so seeing how legit the threat is, both Mr. McSpicklet and Batmite open up a portal and are able to escape. And alas, Whatever happens next will be picked up in Batman Superman World's Finest, issue number 25. And that, folks, was the end of Batman Superman World's Finest Annual 2024. And thank you guys for checking out my video, as it truly, truly means the world to me. So if you're a fan of Silver Age comics, the old school style of storytelling from the 60s, but you would love to see how a modern version of these comics would look like today, then definitely try this book. What I'll say is this, if you're already reading World's Finest and you just want the main story, then you don't need to pick this up. If you're looking for a sampler dish and you're wanting to dive into less talked about characters like Metamorpho, the Challengers, then pick it up. Is the book well written? Yes, but would I deem it as a necessity for the main story? Not really. Sure, we have the first story with the fifth dimensional imps, but I'm fairly certain that Mark Wade will find a way to bring people up to date on the machinations of what happened in this book when it comes to issue number 25. So yeah, as always, I'm a majestic sayer of words Supercliff, and if you guys are new to the channel, then do me a solid by smashing that like and subscribe button, and also the notification bell so you'll never miss out on an upload, and so you'll always be kept up to date with your favorite top tier comics happening in the comic book world. Now tell me, what are your thoughts and opinions on this issue? Are you guys excited for issue number 24? Let me know down in the comment section below. And until the next video, peace. Giggity goo.